All right, so here we have the Samsung Epic. This is the latest 3G, 4G device from Sprint. And the feature that we're showcasing today is AllShare. AllShare is Samsung's uh, name for DLNA. Basically, DLNA uh, allows you to take content, uh, video, music, uh, pictures, and share it uh, with your TV, for example. Uh, and play that content on your TV. DLNA stands for Digital Lifestyle Network Alliance, right? And there's uh, over a dozen companies that are part of that alliance to allow this capability to take place. So from the Epic here, we'll go to Applications, and we'll select All Share, and here we have a few different options. We can actually play content from the phone to another player. Another player, again, could be a TV, could be an Xbox or PlayStation 3. Uh, we can also play content from a server to the phone. So if you have content that's on your phone, on the TV rather, you can actually play it on your phone. All right. Now the last option here, we'll go back, is play a file from a server um, on another player via my phone. So basically you can use your phone as a bridge play content between two DLNA devices. All right. So here from the TV, now that we have the AllShare application launch, uh, we can simply select here on this particular TV, we're using a Samsung LED TV. We'll just select source. And here we have an option for DLNA. And you can see Samsung Mobile is the name of this uh, Samsung Epic that we have. Simply select it. And here, we've got the option to play media. Again, we can do videos, music, photos. Of course, you've got your settings there. So we'll go back to videos. We'll go into that particular folder. Here we have two video, or two pieces of video content. We'll select wildlife. And this video content is what's on the phone. It's actually what's on the phone, correct. And so now it's actually buffering uh, from the phone is buffering that content to the TV and so while that's buffering so this uh, DLNA technology uses Wi-Fi to be able to share that content between the Epic and the actual TV the TV actually has a Wi-Fi dongle connected to the back of it and of course that's just an accessory that you can buy separately uh, from the TV so now that content is buffered and plain. It's the HTC Evo. This is our first 3G, 4G device that we came out with. And here it's actually sitting in what's called the home dock. So the home dock gives you the capability to charge the HTC Evo as well as use the HDMI port at the same time. So we've got the HDMI port here, so full HDMI to the TV, and then we've got our power for charging. So we'll go to source. We'll select that. And here on the Evo, we've got our video content. Now just select this Prince of Persia trailer that we'll play. And there you have it playing over the HDMI port, 720p output. And it's that simple. You also have the capability of undocking the HTC Evo and actually plugging the HDMI port micro HDMI cable to the directly to the HTC Evo. With the dock, it gives you the capability to use the standard HDMI cable. Okay.